I think it's uh, just a, a pure disappointment. We, uh, we worked really hard and uh, we weren't able to sort of ever get over the hump. We were chasing Bucknell for the mo majority of the game. We tied it up at 2-2 and had a, a fair amount of momentum. But uh, at the end of the day, just really disappointed that our season ended this way. And uh, for us, you know, our standards are really high and we're a team that's trying to be in not just the NCAA, but second in, in deep rounds. And so uh, anytime we, we don't make it into that kind of a scenario, we feel like it wasn't a, a successful season. So uh, we have great kids. They worked really hard. They tried really hard. We had some fantastic performances throughout the year. But uh, the bottom line is we're, we're very disappointed to, uh, with the result today. Uh, I mean, obviously it felt really good to get the equalizer, but that's only the, the halfway point, really, I mean, at that juncture. So uh, we knew we had to keep pressing, or at least my mentality was we had to keep pressing and uh, keep forcing the action. And uh, to Bucknell's credit, they were able to, to go down and get a corner with not much time left and, and get a goal. So, uh, you know, in the end, we, d we didn't have enough to get uh, over the top today. Well, I try to take each year at a time. Obviously, you know, you're aware of uh, the number and a streak in that sense. Uh, so we take great pride in that, but each year is its own year, and we were really working hard for this one championship, um, and at the end that would have added on if we had been able to get it. But we don't think about it in terms of the, the streak so much. We, we just try to go each year at a time. So uh, I think it's been an incredible legacy that the, the program's been able to accomplish, and we're really sad and disappointed that we weren't able to continue that this year. Hey!